good morning from day number 24. Whew. I've been doing a lot better with my sleep up until last night. I mean, I've been waking up every night multiple times, but it has been so much better since when I first started. But last night I was up so much. I'm not sure why, but it was raining the majority of the night. And today is the first day on this trip I've had to pack up while it was raining. Um, it slowed down while I was packing my tent away, but it was still sprinkling. And by the time I finished packing it away, it stopped. <laughs> so I don't even have my umbrella out because it's just dripping from the trees right now. Oh, but today they say there is a 30% chance of rain between noon and four and possible thunderstorms. Um, hopefully that means we won't get any. <laughs> This is my latest start on trail since Chipmunk left me. Um, it's, I think I started at 7.20. And I just didn't want to pack up in the rain. And I'm glad I waited because then it stopped. But let me tell you. I'm pretty regular, <laughs> if you know what I mean. And uh, when you hear it pouring outside and you gotta go. And there's no privy. And you're sitting there and you're holding it. <laughs> you're like, oh my god, would you please slow down? Slow down, Rain. And then eventually you're like, okay, I can't hold it anymore. <laughs> and so y'all whip out your umbrella. And you go potty in the pouring rain. Yeah, that's a lot of fun. That's kind of one reason why I like staying where there's uh, shelters with privies. Just because in the morning, then at least if it's pouring rain, I don't have to worry about trying to go toity and getting soaked while I'm doing it. But that's my news for the morning. I don't know where I'm going today. We'll find out. I wonder who Rex was. Well, it was bound to happen. It is raining right now, but very lightly, very, very lightly. So. I don't even have my umbrella out right now. Not worth holding it. Um, hopefully it doesn't get any heavier than this, but yeah, like I said, it was bound to happen. 24 days in, and this is the first time I've piped in the rain. Pretty happy with that, I have to say. Especially if it doesn't get any worse than this. Oh, look at how foggy. Cool. Oh, the mist is blowing. I don't know if you can see that. Probably not, but it's really neat. Another gravestone. I had no idea these were out here. Random. Well, it started to rain a little bit more consistently, consistently, so I broke out my umbrella and the wind picked up too, although right now it's a little calm. Uh, so it helps shield me from some of the wind as well. I love this umbrella. <sighs> I'm going uphill, so I stopped. Plus I can't hold my phone, hold the umbrella, and hold my tracker pose all at the same time. But, I'm hoping this rain slows down or goes away. It's really fun kind of climb uphill using one hand for the trekking pole, one hand for the umbrella. <sighs> Woo. Good day though. It's a good day. Debating about popping in my earphone though because my favorite band put out their newest album on the East and I haven't had a chance to listen to it. So I might have to do that. was raining for a good minute there and had to keep my umbrella out but I love that umbrella guys it's great um I am a roughly halfway to the first shelter I have not decided where I'm stopping today because the mileage is kind of wonky I was hoping to do between 14 and 16 today but the first shelter is I think like 11 point ooh, slippery 11.2 from where I stayed and the next one's not for like 18.4, I think. Um, I'm sure there's dispersed camp spots in between, but I don't know. But I'm definitely at least stopping at the first shelter for lunch. And I'm going to kind of just play it by ear. See how the weather is and how I'm feeling. Because uh, my feet are soaking wet again. And I don't want any more blisters. But And I said I wanted to do a shorter day today. And technically, 18.4 whatever miles is a shorter day than I have done the last two days. But it's still a lot more than I had intended on doing. So we'll see how this plays out. I'll let you guys know. 
raining again, guys. Ow! Just smacked myself with my trekking poles. National Cher or Cherokee National Forest. I'm turning into. Whoo! All right, let's get to going. Sky's getting lighter, guys. Maybe that's a positive sign. It's still raining though. Good evening guys, it's about 5.30. I got to camp at about 12 o'clock, somewhere around there today. Only did 11.2 miles. It was just raining and miserable. Um, and when my feet get wet, they start getting fatigued very quickly and my feet were hurting pretty bad. So I decided to call it quits at 11.2 today. So I'm at Little Laurel Shelter. There's quite a few people there right now. Shelter's full and I think there's somebody else tenting outside of it. Um, just down here about to get some water for the night in um, my dry clothes. I did a stupid thing and I took off my rain kilt because my legs weren't getting wet, but then it started really coming down after I took it off and the whole back of my shorts were soaking wet. So I tried to stay in them a little bit to let them dry, but it was so damp of air. They were not drying even with my body heat. So I ended up uh, switching Mondays and my shorts out to dry clothes and sun's come out as you can tell. It just came out like 10 minutes ago. So I laid out all my stuff trying to hopefully dry it out before the morning. But tomorrow I'm looking to hopefully do a bigger day. Um, as long as the weather cooperates, I'm talking 20% chance of showers before one o'clock in the, or one o'clock in the afternoon. So I guess we'll wait and see, but it's supposed to be a high of 70 tomorrow. So it'll be nice. Hopefully I wake up and the sun is shining and it's a good day to make miles. So I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Right, but then you can get up at 5 a.m. and start hiking again. You're going to get cold when you go to bed. We were both up at 5. That sucks.